What is up and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to talk about VidIQ Chrome extension. So this is a search query which I was getting from a lot of you guys and I decided to make this video. I I am hoping that this will be helpful for you guys. In today's video, we are going to answer certain questions. I'm going to list those questions down right now. That is, the first one is how to install VidIQ Chrome extension. It's a very quick and simple way, which I will show you. How to use VidIQ extension on Chrome. How to use the VidIQ Chrome extension. I'm sorry, that's a repetitive thingy. All together. Uh, so, I'll be showing you what exactly how to read the analytics or how to read the matrix that VidIQ Chrome extension provides you. It's a free tool, of course, but it has limitations when it is you are going to use it as a free user i would highly recommend you to go ahead and purchase the tool it is not that expensive uh, plus it is going to help out the youtubers who are just starting out their channel it's going to help you in terms of uh, your youtube seo which is the most important part that is youtube search engine optimization it will tell you what kind of titles you can go ahead and add which are going to attract more you viewers uh, on your channel it also helps you a lot in terms of the youtube tags that you are supposed to add it will also tell you in terms of the competition that you have on a particular keyword and should you make a video on that or not the next thing that I have is how to install and set up VidIQ to Chrome. Again, this is a very simple thing. Just keep on watching till the end. How to install VidIQ, how to use VidIQ extension for tutorial. Let's get started. Alright, so here we are on the desktop screen. The first thing that you need to do is click on this three dots. Go and uh, check out on more tools. Then go to extensions once you land up on the extensions tab it's going to tell you what are the extensions which are right now installed on your chrome system just click on this hamburger menu and you will find one thing over here that is open chrome web store just click on the web store and search for vid iq it's very simple and it doesn't take a lot of time just click on this particular extension and click on add to chrome again click on add extension now this is basically going to download your file as you can see over here and it's gonna take you to the vidIQ landing page altogether once it is installed and it is done it's going to ask you for your sign up process now as I said it is a free tool however I would highly recommend you to go ahead and purchase the tool I'm going to go ahead and sign up with my Google account that's the testing account that I use for my videos once you are done with that it's going to land you up on this particular page where it is gonna give you some instructions about the vidIQ application altogether however when you go back to your extensions page, now you can see that vidIQ is added on your extension. Uh, if you want to go ahead and pin it over here, you can just click on this more tools, click on the extensions button and uh, I'm sorry, not that way. Uh, just click on the, you can just click on this particular, I don't know, a puzzle icon which says extension, just click on that. And you can pin this extension right over here so you have it handy on your browser anytime you want to go ahead and use the vidIQ tool. Now coming to the point how to use vidIQ extend I mean how to use the vidIQ Chrome extension. So all you need to go ahead and do is go to your YouTube channel or youtube.com. Once you land up over here, you will have to go ahead and search for a query. For example, I am going to type as Pinterest marketing as a search query in my search icon. Once that is done over here, you can see that this is what the vidIQ Chrome extension helps you out with. 
uh, you can understand the search volume as I said the search volume is really high for Pinterest marketing as a keyword this is the keyword that I have typed and the search volume is really high for that let's see about the competition so in terms of the competition when it is showing you in red when this ad over here is in red that means you are not supposed to make a particular video regarding this particular search query that is Pinterest marketing however we can see that right now it is very low which means uh, very few people are actually creating content based on Pinterest marketing the second thing that I have for you over here is search term so it's going to tell you in terms of the highest views that this particular search term for example if your video starts market as in ranking on this uh, keyword how many views are you gonna get and the average number of views that I'm getting on this particular search term is 74,000 which is not bad at all the average subscribers added last seven days so it's going to also tell you in terms of how many videos have been uploaded with regards to Pinterest marketing as a search query on YouTube in the last seven days and as we can see over here it is basically zero out of 17 uh, it's also going to tell you that the CC which basically means that how many current videos are there on YouTube regarding the search query and these are 17 videos that we have average age that is basically an year for the search query the rest of the things that you don't need to go ahead and uh, check out for the another factor it's gonna tell you as I said it's a really helpful tool it's gonna tell you which is the top creator that is ranking for this particular search query and as I can see over here it's Katie Grazer I have no clue who that person is but that's the channel which is, which is ranking on this for this particular search query right now uh, the third thing that we have is it's gonna tell you top channels for this search term vidIQ chrome extension is really helpful trust me guys it's going to tell you a detailed analysis of what exactly are you supposed to do so now these are the top channels for this particular search term these are ranking as we saw above Katie Grazer is the first channel which is ranking for this search term then we have Zoco Marketing and then we have WS Cube Tech. So that's how you read the analysis in terms of the VidIQ Chrome extension. Again, as I said, it's a free tool. So right now it is only giving me these three uh, related opportunities that I can go ahead and create the videos for. And as you can see, it says upgrade to VidIQ Pro for understanding more queries or more uh, opportunities. I'm gonna take you to my paid account where I have my uh, membership with VidIQ and tell you how exactly does it look. All right, so I have switched the tab to the paid uh, account that I have over here and the search query is the same as you can see Pinterest marketing. It's again showing the same score as this Pinterest marketing is something that's a really good keyword to start creating your videos on. Coming to the point where we were just limited on the free account for three uh, related opportunities. Right now, as you can see, Pinterest Marketing Strategy, Pinterest Marketing Tips, Pinterest Marketing 2022, Pinterest Marketing Tutorial, Pinterest for Business. And it's also allowing me an option to go ahead and show all 323 keywords. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click on them. Trust me guys, you need to have a paid plan for vidIQ because vidIQ really helps you out in terms of growing your YouTube channel. And these are the other related keywords, you can say that uh, regarding Pinterest marketing and that's what people are searching for. It's also gonna give you like the basis, it's basically related keywords, related score. So the better or the higher the score is, the better it is for your channel. The search volume, of course, you need to have a good search volume for the keyword. Like Pinterest marketing has 2,74,280 search volume. That is, that's how, that's how many times people are actually searching for it. And we also see the competition, which is a very low competition for this search query. 
that's how you get to know which videos or which topics are you supposed to uh, make the videos on coming back to the main uh, screen over here which it doesn't actually give you in a free plan it is also gonna give you the related queries and this particular data comes from google trends as it is displayed over here it also tracks what exactly google what are people googling for so right now as you can see people are googling for pinterest affiliate pinterest affiliate marketing affiliate marketing marketing on pinterest and you can just toggle more and more options and you can understand what exactly are people looking for and based on that you can create your own videos so this was basically an understanding about uh, the vidIQ chrome extension uh, we have covered in this video how to install vidIQ it's the basic fact just go on your google chrome extensions and i hope you find this particular video helpful and i have helped you in terms of understanding how to read or how to analyze the pinterest uh, i'm sorry uh, the the vid iq chrome extension if you like the video guys please hit the like button and if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel please subscribe to the channel that would be a great favor i'll see you the next time with another query till then keep geeking